Welcome to SunDrum. In this video, we'll show you how to assemble the SunDrum hybrid solar collector into the PV panel. In your SunDrum kit, you will find the SunDrum collector, two insulating panels, and four brackets with clamps. Notice that one bracket has a single mounting clamp. This is the upper bracket, which we'll install first. The grounding hardware consists of nuts, bolts, and two star washers. You'll need a 3 8 and a 7 16 inch wrench. Find a flat, clean area to work on and lay down an old blanket or other soft material that won't scratch the front surface of the PV panels. Carefully lay the PV panel down, face down, and then move the junction box wires out of the way for the installation of the Sundrum solar collector. Now, carefully place the Sundrum collector on the back of the PV panel with the upper cutout around the PV panel junction box. Adjust the position of the Sundrum collector so that it's approximately centered in the PV frame. Identify the upper bracket. This bracket has a sliding wing nut and clamp assembly on the right side, and you'll see a hole for the grounding hardware on the left. To install the bracket, slide the clamp on the right side as far as it will go toward the center, and then align the bracket over the collector so that the two threaded studs on the collector pass through the holes on the bottom of the bracket. Now install the grounding hardware. First, make sure that the hole on the left side of the bracket aligns with the hole on the PV collector frame. Raise the left end of the bracket slightly and slide the quarter inch star washer between the bracket and the PV frame. Now identify the quarter inch nut and bolt. Drop the bolt through the aligned stack of bracket, star washer, and PV frame. And then thread on the nut from underneath, just making a finger tight. Don't tighten it yet. Now locate the number 10 star washer. Use pliers to position the washer within the slot over the threaded stud on the left side of the collector. Find the number 10 lock nut and then use the pliers again to place the lock nut over the same threaded stud. Once you're sure the lock nut is on straight, you can screw it down a few turns with your fingers. Don't tighten it yet. On the right side of the bracket, slide the clamp as far as it will go toward the frame edge, but don't tighten the wing nut yet. Now install the lower bracket. Orient the bracket so the open slot faces the center of the collector. Slide the two clamps toward the center of the bracket and then carefully place the ends of the bracket on the PV panel frame so that the threaded studs on the collector pass through the alignment holes on the bottom of the bracket. Then slide the clamp and wing nut assemblies toward the PV panel frame edge and partially screw down the wing nuts. Not completely tight yet. After verifying that both brackets are in position, take the 3 8 inch wrench and tighten down the lock nut in the upper bracket slot. With the 7 16 wrench, tighten the quarter inch nut and bolt. With the grounding hardware secured, make sure the sundrum panel is centered within the PV collector frame and then tighten all three clamps using the wing nuts.
Now we'll install the two center brackets and the insulating panels. The diagram shows how the insulation panels need to go in at an angle to clear the ports on the collector. Take one insulating panel and one bracket and insert the edge of the insulating panel into the open slot of the bracket. Carefully insert the other edge of the insulating panel at an angle into the open slot of the installed upper bracket so that the insulating panel clears the inlet outlet ports of the collector. Then bring the panel and bracket assembly down carefully so the inlet outlet ports are centered in the insulation panel holes. Here the photo shows a notch on the underside of the bracket that covers half the rivet at collector center. Carefully align the bracket on both sides so the notch half covers the rivet. Then screw down the wing nuts on both sides tight enough to hold the bracket in position. Repeat the procedure with the last bracket and insulating panel making sure to install the panel at an angle so that it clears the inlet outlet ports. Before clamping these brackets make sure they're aligned with the center of the sun drum collector. Then tighten the wing nuts on all four clamps. With all clamps secured, assembly of your Sundrum panel is now complete. Thanks for choosing Sundrum.